What up YouTube, it's Picker Steve. What we're gonna do today is build a hitch for my snowmobile. If you have scrap metal, do not throw it away. Keep it in a pile, even if it's outside. Who cares if it gets rusty? You can always sandblast it, wire brush it, put a wire brush attachment on your grinder, strip it down, put rust bonding paint on it, what have you. Just don't throw that stuff away because you never know when you're gonna use it. So what we're gonna do today, trailer hitch for my snowmobile. So it's compatible to all my farm implements like my log arch, and dump trailer, what have you. So stay tuned, we're gonna fabricate a hitch for my snowmobile. Yep, I'm cutting up a perfectly good trailer hitch ball, but it's inch and one seven eighth, just what I need. I'm gonna weld that on next. Okay, it's going good. Fabrication's coming along good. Not having any problems with my welding rods or anything like that. <clears throat> uh, I'm just putting the finishing touches on the hitch and probably grind down all the welds and then paint her up, slap it on the snowmobile. I'll be back. Wind's kind of messing with me here. What are you gonna do? Can't help the conditions you're given. You gotta play the hand you dealt sometimes. You get the gist of it, right? Okay, YouTube. At this point in the process, um, we're mounted up to the snowmobile. My snowmobile shed, drive in, drive out, ramps on either side. So what I decided to do was mount this with U bolts. Um, they stick out a little bit, but I could cut them off if I want. But if you're following along and you're building something similar in this part of the process, um, I would suggest using Loctite on the nuts. I can't find mine at the moment, so um, I'm probably going to end up double nutting these things. Don't take that the wrong way. So, here we go. Snowmobile trailer hitch fabrication. And... If you're wondering why that block of wood's in there, because I've been using a chain to drag logs out of the woods with this thing. And my bar has gotten misshapen, so that's just a space filler at this point. And um, the other thing we need is snow. We don't have any snow right now. We had six inches, and we got two inches of rain, and it warmed up to 50 degrees. So now it's all gone. And it's almost January of 2020, or 2021. So yet one more kick in the nuts for this year. So not getting a lot of sled time. Thanks for watching.
contribute to the channel if you liked it. I'll keep putting out more content.